Hey everybody, it's Miss Andrea from the Williston Library here today to bring you candy cane coating and um, our cool steam kit that we have avail available. So at the time of me recording this, which is uh, about 3.15 on Friday, we have about 12 kits left. So if you haven't grabbed your kit yet, come on into the library and do that. We are open today until 5. Tomorrow and Sunday we're open from 1 to 5. Uh, and these are free. Anybody can grab one. Um, so what we're doing today is we're going to be talking about binary coding, which for those of you who aren't sure what that means, and I am by no means an expert, but basically in the computer world, um, the language is built of zeros and ones. Um, so as you can see on our little cheat sheet here, it tells you what the binary code to each letter is in capitals and in lowercase as well. Um, so the... the um, point of this activity is to just get kids familiar with coding and things like that and how everything works. So in your kit, you I'm going to set this aside here because I already have one open. You are going to find that you have some red beads, some white beads, some clear beads, um, a white pipe cleaner, and then some uh, green ribbon. The ribbon is just in case you wanted to make this an ornament. Maybe you wanted to hang it on your uh, the City of Williston's Christmas tree for the Christmas tree contest, the Christmas ornament contest. Uh, which you have until Sunday to do that, so you could turn it into an ornament. And so the goal of, of what we're doing today is, you know, to learn about binary coding, and we're going to, the challenge is that you're going to um, pick a word that uh, you want to create using these beads. So basically the red beads are your zeros, the white beads are your ones, and the clear beads are your spaces. Um, so... And the trick is also you have to get it into a candy cane shape. So you can't choose a word that's super long or it's not going to fit onto the chenille stem or the pipe cleaner. Uh, like I was, I would love to do my name, but my name is just too many letters. It's, it's not going to fit. And for time's sake, what I'm going to do today is actually um, fold my chenille stem in half and do a smaller letter. So I'm actually going to fold it in half and then I'm going to twist around here to make it a little more sturdy. Again, just for time's sake, once, once we do the first one, you guys are going to get this right off the bat. And then, you know, shape it into our candy cane shape. Well, that's a pathetic looking candy cane, but you get the idea. So I'm going to go ahead and use the word snow today, S-N-O-W. So I'm going to look at my, my cheat sheet here and figure out that S is going to use one, two, three, four zeros and one, two, three, four ones. And again, the zeros are white and the ones, I'm sorry, the zeros are red, the ones are white because typically you're going to have more zeros than you are ones, so you have more red beads than white beads. Um, but have fun with it, you know, use, I would suggest maybe three or four letter words because um, that's probably how many beads you're going to have, but that's part of the challenge is you have to figure out what word you're going to use to, co to coordinate with how many beads you have. So if I were to do the word snow, I'm going to, let's see, so zero, one, zero, zero, one, zero, one, I already messed up, zero, one, zero, one, zero, I already messed up again, zero, zero, one. You can tell I'm I'm getting older. This stuff is a little confusing to me. Okay, zero one zero one zero zero one one. Oh, okay. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that in binary code is the letter S. And then I'm gonna put a spacer in there um, to represent that. That is my first letter. Then, and that's a capital S, by the way. Um, so let's do a lowercase n. So we're going to do 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1. zero. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so each letter has eight 
um, either zeros or ones in there. So that, that's helpful. So then I'm going to use another spacer. So now I have SN. I'm going to do O. So 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So there's my spacer again. So I've got S and O. Now I want to do W. Let's see if I have enough here. Ooh, I don't know that I'm going to have enough. Maybe I'll do a capital W instead because I think I have enough for capital W. Um, so I'm going to look at my cheat sheet here again and look at that capital W. And 0 is red. 1 is white, 0, 1, oh, I'm kind of getting off the page here. There we go. Um, ooh, 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 I might not have enough. 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, ooh, oh, I have just enough. 1, 1. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, what am I missing? Zero, one. Oh, I had a zero in there. Zero, one, zero, one, zero. One, one, one. Apparently, this is not as easy as it looks. So here is my letter, or my word snow in, in binary code. S, capital S, lowercase n, lowercase o, capital W. So in computer world, all of these things are happening in the background. So we just see all the cool pictures and, and all the cool images and things like that. But in the background, every single thing has a code to it. And that's how it magically transforms into computer world. Again, it's, it's more than I know about. Um, I just know the very basics like this. Um, so I, we encourage you to use your uh, candy cane coding steam kit to make uh, the word of your choice. Um, like I said, I was able to do snow. Um, maybe, you, maybe you'll be able, maybe you have a, a four letter name or you could do joy or maybe candy or, you know, try it out. Use all the different beads. Uh, reds are zeros. Ones are white. Uh, maybe you have more beads at home that you want to um, incorporate different words into, but it's a fun activity uh, to teach you the very, very beginnings of, of binary code. If you want to learn more, um, you know, you can always research the internet. Oh, now I just messed up my, my word. Um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to put it on the candy cane here. We're going to try our hardest here. Um, Let's see what we're going to do. So, uh, S, 0, 0, and I'm just going to curve this a little bit here to get it to stay on there. Okay, so S is 0, 1, ah, these are tricky. This is good for dexterity, too, if you need a little help with your dexterity. These picking up beads is great for that. Zero one, let's see, zero one zero one zero zero. Good grief, Miss Andrea. One ah, one one, and then our space. Ooh, I don't know if this word's gonna fit on a double. So that's S. I don't know if it's going to fit on a double. I might have to make it singular after all. I don't think all those beads are going to fit on there. See, this is part of the challenge. So I'm going to unwind it. You, you guys can tell I did not practice this before I, I did my video. Okay. Start with a loop again at the bottom to keep all those beads on. All right. Here we go. S, zero, one, zero, one, zero, zero, 
one, one. And our space. Okay. So we're going to follow that down to the bottom. There we go. So now we have, just tie that a little bit there. Now we have our S. Okay. We're going to go for the N, the lowercase n. Zero, one, one, zero, one, 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 zero, and a space. So now we have S N. Okay? And now we're going to do our lowercase O. Zero, one, if I can get down there. One, one, zero, one, one, ah! one, one, space. And now we're going to do our, so there we have S N O. Now we're going to do our capital W. Okay, so zero. One, zero, one, zero, one, one, one. Ta-da! Okay, it worked. S, N, O, W. Now I'm going to bend this over and stick the remainder of the pipe cleaner in there. Oh, just tug on that a little bit. And you want to leave a little bit so that way it, they don't all fall off and you kind of want to leave this. There we go. Okay, and I'm just going to take my scissors and clip that part off. All right, so now, dun, da, da, da. well, let's do it this way, right? Because this was our S. So now we have the word snow on our candy cane. Ta-da! How cool is that, right? So the other thing you could do is like maybe you could make, you know, one letter if you wanted to do more of these and you had more supplies. You could like make your whole name. And then if you wanted to turn it into an ornament, what I would do is take your two ends of your string here create a loop and just pull these through and there you go and then you tie the top and ta-da your binary code candy cane with the word snow pretty cool it's like a secret little language thank you guys so much for joining like I said uh, currently we have about 12 kits available as of 325 uh, when I'm ending this video, we are open until 5 p.m. this evening, Friday, and Saturday and Sunday, 1 to 5. Uh, hopefully, we'll see you, and you guys have a great afternoon. Bye!